Ah, it is time, ladies and gentlemen. It is time. What's going on, guys? This is your boy, Project Iceman. I'm bringing you another, another, another episode of Pokemon Rejuvenation. This is version 5 that just came out a couple of days ago, if I remember correctly. If not, a week. Uh, from the looks of it, I'm probably going to be the first person who recorded this. Not sure if I'm going to be the first person who uploaded, but I'm definitely one of the first people who recorded this at this time. Um, can't wait to get back in this. I'm going to be uh, uploading probably um, Wednesday, um, right after work. So stay tuned for that. Um, as for as for um, what my schedule is going to be with Pokemon Legends in the Arena. Um, it might be on and off. I'm not gonna like all do it like I did with Chaos and um, Chaos and uh, the other game when I was playing Celestite. It's just too much to handle to do like an equal amount of videos and then schedule them day by day like that. So it'll be a surprise when it comes out. But let's get started with the actual gameplay, shall we? My team's looking nice right now. Look at that. Look at my team. There we go. Now, let's check out my uh, Pokemon. Ooh, the layout looks a little bit different. We got Poldu, uh, Jolly Nature. Try attack signal beam hyper beam and zap cannon. We have Declan with surf, rape, bird, aqua ring, feather dance. We have Roxy level 68 with flare blitz, outrage, rock climb, extreme speed. We have Christmas, the, um, the subtile level 68 with giga drain, strength, slash and burn, and rock smash. We have Lancelot level 70 with blue blast, psychic, calm mind, and story power. And we have Zilla. Level 68 with uh, Dragon Pot, Head Smash, Earthquake, and Rock Slide. We also have a couple of backup Pokemon that I can use at any moment. This is what our backup team is looking like right now. Um, oh, right. I forgot to train this thing up. Oh, right. And I found a shiny one of these. I think I'll train this thing up as well. Oh yeah, the, um, the, the Oshawott that I found that was stolen. I have a, I also have Lana, and I might actually end up trading this guy because I actually have a Mega Stone for him. Not sure when we're ever going to get the Mega Ring, but, you know, just to, just a, something to look forward to. Oh yeah, I have the shiny, I forgot I had this thing. <laughs> We also have Doctor, the Contrarian. We have Jawea. Oh, I need to train him up. I I need to train him up. Most oh! Oh, right! Oh my goodness, this looks beautiful! I called this Sim Rowan. He was, it was the, um, the, the Shadow, the Shadow Pokemon that Rowan B had. But it didn't have this design for sure. I know it didn't have this design before. I think the designs have changed. Hemp, Sun and Moon confirmed. Look at that. <laughs> we also have Sav Savage, the Huge Power, Bright Powder, um, Diggersby, Getsuga, uh, Sabrina, Girly Bean. Oh, right, Fusion. <laughs> I forgot about this thing. We might actually use that as well. Ah, Tesla. We can't forget about Tesla. So that's what our backup team is looking like so far. Um, is there any Pokemon that I want to switch up? Hmm. Let's put Christmas in the box for now. Looks like he's pretty high level as well. Everyone's in the 68s. Oh. 
Where did this egg come from? Is this a trophy's egg I got a while back? It might be, it looks like it. Oh, why did the train stop? Is it really that important? So Aaron didn't find Saki, Valerie, Adam, or Brakeson? I'm not one to worry, but this is starting to bug me. Oh my, does something serious happen? I'll make sure Luxon and I come up with a solution pronto. So apparently Crystal sent Kanan somewhere. She wouldn't even tell me where. I wish Kanan would have spoken to me about this. Oh, excuse me. I thought this cabin was empty. Oh, Aaron, you're going to take the Grand Express with us after all? Yeah, Crystal gave me her ticket. She said she didn't need any. Lady Luck truly shines her luck on me today, hasn't she? Give me a break. Mind if I stay here? Oh, uh, yeah, of course. I can't believe I'm in this situation. You mean Elena, correct? Yeah, her. Hey, you guys said you knew her before. Was she always stupid and reckless? I wouldn't call her stupid, but she... Say no more, I get the picture. She's always been their troublemaker. W wait for me! Kanan! Uh, hello, I am here. Hey, nice hair. Thanks, you too. <laughs> I see they like <laughs> white hair. Cannon, where have you been? If you got here any later, the train would have been take would have taken off without you. I know, I'm sorry, but Crystal really wanted me to do something. What did Crystal want you to do? It was really weird, but she said I had the dragon's potential. The dragon's potential? Sounds like a bunch of BS, but I'll play along. Where did you even go? Well, you did have a Salamence, so that is a dragon's potential if I've ever seen one. I actually don't know where I was. Well, clearly you wouldn't know where you were. You're not exactly from here. Ah, uh, skip some dialogue. Was didn't look like anywhere anything around here. I I can't explain it. Then no, done. No, it's simple. Just think about it when you get the sun when you get sun. Man. When you get some cohesive then tell us. Looks like the train is finally moving. We're very close to Grand Chief City. Sit tight and we'll be there before you know it. Mm-hmm. So they're back. Ma'am, you called me? Medellis, do you know how much time you've costed me? I I beg your pardon? Do you know all the trouble you caused this organization? Do you? I know I haven't been exactly been the top-notch admin lately, but Due to your actions, our Shadow Pokemon experience is a complete shambles. Because of you, our operation in Valor Mountain ended with complete and utter failure. It was your arrogance that split the team apart. Alone we are nothing, but together we create an unstoppable force to be reckoned with. It disgusts me to know that you were unaware of this crucial, critical, crucial and very obvious fact. If you had just followed Gira's procedure, Malia would be in our hands. But no, you had to get your personal feelings involved. It's such a shame. Those feelings have caused Garrett to be unable to function as a member of Team Zen AV Bird. Wait, what? What do you mean? What happened to Gira? This isn't about Gira. This is about your competence. But it's in my best interest to know what happened to you. Do not waste my time with your trivial needs. You will. I don't care if it's trivial. If I... Shut your mouth! Ugh. Know your place, Worm. You, you slashed me. Know that it is your fault that your blood spills on them to the floor. You have continued to infuriate me with every waking second. Know that you are disposable and that you are nothing, Medellis. From this point onward, you are no longer a high-ranked member of Team Zen. Y you're firing me? Fire you? No, I refuse to let you off easy. I have a better idea in mind for you, Medellis. Listen carefully, but this is your final chance. Fail this, and well, I'm sure you will know what happens next. This is what you're to do. Attention passengers, we have finally reached Grand Dream Station. Thank you for choosing the Grand Express as your method of travel, and we wish you the best. Okay, <laughs> is he still saying that? Huh. Uh, wrong room. Uh, this one. I'm guessing I either go outside or go to the room. 
Okay, looks like I have to go outside. Um, before that, let me check out the items. Yeah, let's get a couple of hyper versions. Finally made it. It feels like we've been trying to get here for so long. That's because it has been forever. I'm just glad that I don't have to be confined to a train anymore. Unfortunately, I don't have that luxury. I'm going to take the train back home to Rump Valley. I'll see if Elita made it back herself somehow. See you all later. She left as quick as she came. Oh well, we'll see you later, I'm sure. Excuse me. Gosh, I thought we'd never get back here. Patience is a virtue, Flora. Yeah, well, who cares about virtues anyway? I mean, I do, but... Ugh. Heh, <laughs> just relax, Flora. Save your sass for when we confront Cassandra about what we found in Dark Light Woods. Actually, Flora, why don't you do that yourself? What? Why? You wanted to talk to Cassandra for months. Well, this is true. I feel like I'll get too hot-headed. She won't listen to me anyway. I suppose. I just find it really weird. Ah, never mind. That's neither here or there. I'll set up the meeting by myself then. We'll talk later, Shen. We should get going too. Don't have to tell me twice. Let's move. I'm sorry, is there a problem? You four are not native to Grand Dream City, is that correct? We're not. We're just visiting. Ah yes, of course. Before you enter though, we're going to have to take a medical action first. Medical action? Correct. As you can plainly tell, Grandview City lies beneath the dome. In order to prevent disease from spreading, we're going to give each of you a special vaccine. This will make sure you're immune from disease within the dome, and to protect native citizens from outer disease. This is me. I've been here before when I was younger, but I don't remember this being the city. The system was created when Cassandra was elected into office. It's here to ensure the safety of outsiders and insiders all the same. V vaccines You mean what? Needles? Yes, of course. Now which one of you will be going first? Uh, I'll do it. I'm tough. We'll see about that. Name? It's Venom. 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 Ah, here we are. Venom. Also known as Veronica. Yes, you'll be getting the purple vest. Y yeah, whatever. Just do it. Is, is that it? I told you, Melia. He's easy. Uh-huh. Next, I'll go. Name? My name is Kane. 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 That's strange. I don't have any info about you. Is this your first destination upon arriving to the Avon region? Uh, I guess. I suppose that's why. No big deal, though. I'll give you the generic purple vaccine. Hold on. Thank you. Next. And you are? Oh, I know who you are. You're Shen. I've already given you your vaccine. You don't need any more. What? This has, that has to be some kind of mistake. This is Shen's first time being in Grand Chief City. Um, I'm sure I gave Shen their vaccination a long time ago. But I suppose I could be wrong. Oh, right! Didn't Florin say something about me actually bullying him at one point in time? How peculiar. I'll just give you the Rack's vaccination like last time, I think. Giving someone more than one vaccinate, vaccine is fine, right? Anyway, last one. Name? Malia. 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 Oh, oh dear. D don't tell me you've already given me my vaccination already. No, it's actually the opposite. You're listed for the golden vaccination. Golden vaccination? Yes, it's a rare type of vaccine we have that I've never used before. In fact, we only have one in stock. I I'm sorry like, if I get a little flustered. I wanted to use this for the longest time. Ready? There, you're all done. Thanks. Let's get out of here, Shen. Interesting. Why are there vaccinations of different colors? Oh? Malia, Kanan, is that you? C could it be? Oof. It's nice to see you too, Kanan. 
I'm sorry, have we met before? Malia, don't you recognize her? Well, I guess you wouldn't. She was only around for a few days. San... Rodia. My name is Rodia. Oh, I get it. Rodia. Karina notified me that you are coming to Grand Chief City. Who are your friends? These two are Shannon Benham. They know about back then. Oh, I see. Uh, I don't know what you mean by back then, but my name is Huey. Huey? That name sounds familiar. Is that an actual person? Or maybe they just reused the name? Huey does sound familiar. Hmm. Heh, <laughs> it's nice to meet you all. Sheesh, where are my manners? Huey here is one of my close friends. He's one of my roommates back at home. Yeah, we have this huge penthouse because Rhodey is a Grand Dream City community manager. That's just a fancy phrase for saying I take care of community affairs. Listen, we have a lot of time to catch up later. I have to drop something off by the central building before it's too late. I do not want to get scolded by Cassandra. Trust me, it ain't pretty. I'm sure you are all eager to explore the city, so I'll leave you to that. When you're done, meet me by the central building. I'm sure you'll need somewhere to stay for your time here. Don't worry, I got you guys to hook up. Thank you so much, Rodia. Hey, come on, Huey. I need you there as well. Yeah. I'll see you guys later. It was cool to meet you and all. Well, she was nice. That's just how she is. Sassy, but nice. She got... older. Uh, yeah. That's how time works, Ken. No, I mean... No, I mean she got older. When she was with me back in Ambriot Town, she was only nine years old. Uh, unless they feed people something weird here in Dream City. She does not look like a nine-year-old. She probably traveled to a much earlier point in the future and grew up here. And talk about a transformation. She doesn't even use her birth name. Kane is right. When she was back with us in Ambriot Town, she was known as Sandra. Yeah. As much as I want to learn some spicy details about Rodia, I'd rather explore the city. When we're done exploring, we should meet by the central building, right? Where is the central building? My memory is a bit foggy, but I believe it's in the center of the city, and central building. We're by the southern end of the city, so I suppose heading north will give us some results. Right, now let's not waste any time. Let us explore this city. Did you just get off that train with Lore? Isn't she so sweet? She warms the world's heart with her botanical garden. Oh, so that's a building. It looked like a walkway. Let's save the game. Ah, I like waiting on the tracks and then jumping off when a train appears. What do you mean that's not safe? Of course that's not safe! <laughs> do you know how fast these trains might- Oh! Oh my goodness. I can't believe they put the sun and noon music in this. You think you could just walk in the city? Oh no, I'm going to send you straight back to here. Ah, I missed this music. Nice miss. Never mind. <laughs> it just took a lot longer to do than expected.
Well, I guess it's time to head back to Garen myself. I'm actually from Garen myself. Mother used to live in one of the apartments. <coughs> halt! I'm on the lookout for suspicious people. Hmm. You don't look too suspicious. Alright, I'll let you go for now. It looks like you're just in time for the Festival of Dreams. It's a time where we celebrate the city's accomplishments. It's very fun and there's a lot of good food as well. Aren't you Shen? Yes, we met at Golden Leaf Town once. Remember the time we jailed you out for a crime you didn't commit? Those were good times, weren't they? <laughs> Being out at night is can be dangerous, but don't worry, I'll take good care of you. As you battle me. Oh, right, I have signal beam. Oh, this gun do pretty good track of one. Confusion? Yay. Will you hurt yourself? Blossom is generally pretty slow, so... I did say you were slow, but I didn't think you were that slow. I'm a couple of levels below you, though. So, yay! Stoutman. Intimidate. <laughs> that worked against you. That's doing nothing. This is gonna hurt. Not chill, surprisingly. Now this is gonna hurt. say you're gonna take good care of me? <laughs> Ooh, this place is huge. Is it angels? Is it devils? Whisper it into my ear.
Fall zu diesem Match. Let me go, Gravity. That's on my shoulder. Wake up, show appreciation. Are you singing something? I can't tell. Uh, we don't have to use the hyper potion just yet. Wait, why is fresh water so low? Why is soda pop so low? At least moon milk is the same. This looks like an upcoming double battle. Eh, that's fine. Sorry, am I bugging you? I see what you did there! Nice hat, bro. What's an aroma doing like a lady doing outside at night? There are nocturnal aromas if you don't know. Ah, Pokemon Center. <coughs> a huge one too, apparently. Huh? You want me to heal your Pokemon? I think you've mistaken me for my sister, Joy. She's still at her post, but I'm off duty. So please don't bother me. I have a life as well. <laughs> Hello, welcome to the Dream District Pokemon Center. We were story exhausted and worn out Pokemon to full health. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Yeah. Why am I repeating the nice joy? Thank you for waiting, sh Oh. We've successfully restored- Interesting, so they changed the dialogue a little bit. I like that. My culture has been through a lot recently. I brought him here so that he would feel better. Hopefully that's actually the case. <coughs> so what's my level cap? 75? I'm actually pretty under level, considering. Henrietta and Jeff coming live to you from G DC at night because we have nowhere to stay. Ugh, this is ridiculous. We turn our heads for a moment and we turn our heads for a moment and Volta disappears. We don't even have a place to stay without her. What's this? The city is so quiet at night. It's great. There's also a nice breeze and comfortable breeze. You probably heard this before, but it doesn't even feel like we are in the dome. Ah. I was born in the Bleedest Town, but was forced to move here. <coughs> Tank. 
that's not doing anything. Not unless you have a berry. Or a stockpile. I think that's just enough for the second one. town is on its last legs. This bridge has been fixed, so now you can access Route 7 without any problems. Ah, so this goes back to Route 7, huh? Let's heal up again, and we'll call it an episode. Uh, 32 minutes down. Uh, next episode, we'll be checking out more of this town. This town is ridiculously huge. Alright then, guys. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Later.